welcome back to beauty and soul with darian so i have another video for you guys today today this video is a fun one they're all fun okay but guess what we're gonna do today we're gonna do a luxury candle unboxing so i bought these a few weeks ago maybe yeah a few weeks ago those i purchased these candles because they were having an online sale and i actually have used this candle line before forever mood by uh, jackie aina and because they were luxury you know i kind of wanted to like i i burn candles a lot like i just kind of run through them because i just love good smelling stuff i love the home to just smell good you know smell like cookies and stuff like that so i kind of when i first purchased these candles it was over a year ago i just kind of burned them slightly but now i have re-upped on these candles so i'm excited to smell some new scents and see what they have out there okay well it's here now because i purchased it but you know see what's here now for me to burn and just relax and you know maybe you want to take a bubble bath and you know have a glass of wine or some hot cocoa whatever your thing is i really like these candles so i feel like they are you know good for that okay i feel like it helps set that you know relaxation i'm having a self-care you know moment right now type of feel so as you can see i have not opened the candles yet i literally have the box right here waiting for you guys because i wanted to smell the new scent that i have not smelled before with you guys and read a little bit of the description that they have on the individual boxes and go through the ones that i bought okay so if you're somebody who likes a lot of um more earthy natural smelling candles and stuff like that um this may or may not be the video for you i love Stuff that smells sweet, super sweet, so like fruity and sweet are, I like a lot of stuff that's vanilla and that kind of scent family, but I feel like these candles are very nice, so even if you don't like, um, you know, certain scents, they have a good variety of other scents that you can try out, so let's go ahead and get started opening these candles. Okay, so <laughs> candle number one. This is uh, the candle Soft Life. And I saw this and I was like, first of all, we're supposed to already be living this type of lifestyle as women. I know sometimes life can make your heart want to be hardened. So uh, when I saw this, I was like, let me get this, you know. Okay, ladies, so this is just not, uh, you know, this soft life thing is not supposed to be like a phenomenon or whatever. We're supposed to be able to rest and, you know, you know, be feminine, be yourself. It's okay to like girly stuff. It's okay to just be you as a woman. Okay, so I picked up this candle and it says on here, it's the baby girl lifestyle. <laughs> so this candle is a little different as far as like the decor on the box and i'm gonna see if there's any decor on the actual candle because this is from a special collection there is a nigerian artist that designed the art on the box and the the look so that's pretty cool and let's open up the candle wow so as i opened it you know this is a good reminder to just enjoy your life and live your life so it says tomorrow isn't promised enjoy now and i'm going to take a second to just you know speak to that because a lot of times we push things back like let's just do this later or i'll do this you know in a year from now or here and there and all this stuff do it now if you can do it now enjoy your life now and continue to enjoy it as you get older okay so i just have to put that in there I don't know if you can see it, but that is the inside of the box. Let's take this candle out. So let's smell it. Mmm. Definitely, it just smells. It's giving me vanilla. It's giving me cinnamon. It's giving me dessert okay i like it this one i don't see the the like the top notes and all that stuff on the box for this one so i'm gonna actually go on the website and see what it has on there for you guys okay so i have it pulled up i already love this it says for the girl who has it all and wants more 
I just like that mindset because I am finally learning to rest in the fact that as far as life, like the good things in life, you can have the good things in life. I am just learning to rest and continue to believe and work towards what you want and with God's blessing, I believe that all shall go well. Don't put limits on God, don't put limits on your life, okay? So it says the candle soft life, the decadent scent is made from sugar, spice, and everything pricey. Okay, so I smelled the cinnamon in the top notes. It has cinnamon, caramel, and ginger. And the heart notes, they call it, are the heart. It says buttercream, vanilla icing, and nutmeg. And in the base, it says sugar, and clove okay so i guess two of the things the vanilla and the cinnamon if you know what vanilla and cinnamon smells like most people do um you probably will like this candle it's very sweet it's giving me dessert like um so that's exactly how i like my candles to smell all right let's move on to the next candle so this one actually has a description on the box and this one is thirst trapping okay i don't believe in thirst trapping but the scent of this candle seemed pretty good so i'm gonna go over the scent details so i actually purchased this candle because i love like fruity scents that are sweet so i love like uh pineapple that type of stuff that is the type of candle that i usually gravitate towards if it's more of a, a fruity candle our fruity scent in general even like a perfume so the scent details this one says the top notes it is watermelon apple pineapple the heart note is raspberry apricot and the base note is cotton candy and vanilla so when i saw the cotton candy i was like it's a must I'm gonna add this so the candles are 10 ounces and it says the burn time is up to 65 hours they're 100 percent natural coconut soy wax and for this specific candle it says the throw is moderate so i feel like that is pretty good use uh from a candle when i burned the other ones uh it was a little while ago but i know I did enjoy I enjoyed the scent and then I also um, feel like I got a pretty good amount of burn time and I burn my candles a lot and I love candles so I feel like I constantly have them going like constantly trying to get finished with one so I can get to the next one here was the box I opened the box already so here is the candle this is really cute now let's smell this candle Mm. so i give it a 10 out of 10 smelling this candle it reminds me of fruity bubble gum like uh from childhood it just reminds me of bubble gum but it's like flavor like maybe watermelon or strawberry i don't know if you remember uh from childhood you know the gum the, sh the sugar gum that is what this is reminding me of like i love this this is something that I definitely feel like I will enjoy burning. I'm probably gonna wait until probably the springtime or the summertime and then take this one out and just enjoy the summer like scent. All right guys, so the next candle is Forever Moves Matcha Business. So the scent details for this candle, it says the top notes are hazelnut coffee. So I actually drink all of my coffee at least for right now in this season with hazelnut creamer so this is perfect i feel like i'm already gonna like this so the top notes are hazelnut coffee almond milk honey the heart notes are coffee and lavender and the base notes are vanilla okay i told you i like vanilla so there's the vanilla again this says the throw is bold so let's open the candle i'm trying not to mess up the packaging This smells so good. This reminds me of a coffee shop. Mm. This is giving coffee shop, but money, okay? <laughs> it literally is giving me like the feel of like some money. It's like it smells like money and coffee. Money and coffee is what I'm getting from this uh, candle scent. That's amazing how scents can like take you to like a place where you feel like it reminds you of a place or it's giving you like a this is what this feels like. I literally smell this candle 
I think of coffee and money, wealth and coffee. Okay. <laughs> So, um, I feel like this is definitely going to be something that I will enjoy. And it's also um, bolder. Uh, the throw says bold and I like bold scent. I like when the scent like fills up the whole house or room or, you know, I like the whole like place smelling good. So, I'm really, I believe, going to enjoy this one. Okay, so the next one is... Holly Berry. Okay, so when I was looking on the website and ordering, I just kept thinking of that song. Um, I think I was in middle school, Miss Berry, Miss Berry. Hello, Holly. <laughs> so I was like, I have to get this. I'm not usually somebody who goes to like a lot of berry scents and stuff like that, but I was like, let me get this. I can already kind of smell it, I feel like, from the box, so I'm glad I got it. So the scent is Holly Berry, and it says Holly Berry and under the mistletoe on the box so the scent details the top notes are green cardamom clove buds pink pepper the heart is holly leaves that's cute and the uh oh holly leaves black currant cranberry and the base is fresh pine elemi and cedar wood i just think that's so cute and this is the inside is so cute I feel like this candle is good, like it's a bold scent because I can already smell it. I can already smell it through the box and it smells good. This is giving Christmas time. Mmm. This is giving Christmas time. It's like, you know, brings back those sentiments. Like I feel like I've smelled this before in my life. Or something similar but um definitely for like bringing back memories and just you know giving you that christmas time feel this candle i like and they also far have had the same color on the inside so all right so this next candle is mallow dramatic when i saw the name i was like <laughs> Let's get this. Well, after some convincing, okay. So the scent detail says the top notes are cardamom, cinnamon. The heart is creamy coconut, frothy milk, and the base is charred marshmallow accord. So I really got this uh, candle because I knew that there was marshmallow in it. So that kind of was like, okay, I might like this. And then like the frothy milk and creamy coconut it was kind of like, let's try this out. So. Um, let's open this up and smell it. Okay. I like the, um, like the, the pictures on here. This is really cute. The little, the lady skiing. So, let's smell. This smells good. This smells good. It's sweet, but it has a, it has something I feel like to balance it out. It's not super sweet where it's like overly, like too much. This actually is like, I feel like this smells like my first apartment. Like when I first moved, it kind of has a hint of something that's reminding me of that. Yeah, this is actually making me feel like, like think back to my first apartment. Okay, she has upgraded since. <laughs> that um, place was terrible. But I am very, actually, very grateful and thankful that I lived there because to see the progress and the upgrade, um, I'm thankful. And, you know, that was my first apartment, like living on my own. So it's still, even though there was a lot of stuff going on um, there with like management and stuff and just, it was some drama but I still really enjoy it. like I don't regret that being my first apartment even though you know like we look at stuff and be like I wish I would have did this or that I don't regret it like I learned uh, throughout that process yeah yeah that apartment um, had some things that weren't nice though okay <laughs> okay so I'm still just like um been smelling this so this is very sweet and it has a mm, 
I don't want to say adult or grown ups. It just has a very, it's very balanced. I feel like it's sweet, but it's balanced. And it's very like warm and cozy. Like it's making me feel like that. And I actually was getting marshmallow from this. So that's a good thing. If it sounds like I am being super loud, I'm actually trying to project my voice because in real life my voice sounds lighter than it does probably on the camera um so i am probably speaking loud or louder if it's too loud it's just i'm trying to project my voice because i'm using my camera to film and i just want to make sure that the audio is picking up my voice okay so i'm kind of projecting my voice so if it's a little loud don't be alarmed okay so the next candle so I feel like I've had this one before. I feel like this is a repurchase actually. This one is Caked Up. And the reason I repurchased is of course because you know the scent is sweet. This is something I want to go back to. So it says the top notes are roasted pistachio, almond cream, pineapple. The heart notes are honey, jasmine, coconut, and the base are a vanilla bean and must so this is definitely something i wanted to go back to and it says the throat is bold so let's open this up and then i love pink i love the color pink so this is perfect it's giving fabulous <laughs> this is the candle and it's very sweet it's very sweet i definitely i definitely smell the almond cream and I feel like the vanilla bean is kind of like, it's subtle, it's hidden. Um, but what's standing out is the honey and the almond cream. And those two things already just kind of give me that, like I'm taking a bubble bath type of feel. So definitely recommend this one. Next candle is Sun Kiss and Tell. Okay, cute, cute. So Sun Kiss and Tell. Um, it says closed mouths don't get kissed. Okay. Um, first of all, don't kiss me <laughs> if I don't want you to kiss me. All right. <laughs> but the scent details it says the top notes are agave, nectar, sugar, banana, almond blossom. The heart notes are orange flower, tuberose, white jasmine, creamy coconut, and the base is marshmallow musk and vanilla bean so normally i wouldn't go to stuff that is floral like has floral stuff in it but i decided to try this candle out because it had like the sugar banana the nectar it has the creamy coconut it has the vanilla bean and the marshmallow so i felt like that was enough to give it that sweetness uh, for me to like it so i'm gonna open this one up so sunkiss and tell Mm, this is giving beach. This smells like a type of lotion. This is giving me a beach vibe. It smells good. I definitely can smell the banana. Maybe it's reminding me of like sunscreen. I don't know if that was the, you know, the purpose of the scent of this candle, but it's giving me sunscreen type of feel. So there's actually a sunscreen that I have used that's actually out there that has that banana like scent. And this is reminding me of that, okay? So this is the feel that that is giving. It's giving summer. It's giving out on the beach, on the little chair, the lounge chair, watching the water, you know, flow, come up to the shore. It's giving that clear, clean water, you know, on the island. And so here is the last candle. This is Sweet Wade. I'm not sure if this is a double, Probably not, but it's in a different box, so let's open it. No, it just had extra protection. So here is Sweet Wave, and because it has the name Sweet Wave, I am assuming it's sweet. That's more than likely, um, I saw vanilla or something in it and just was like, let me try this one out. And it has the tropical-like, you know, decor but i think it's a little different than the other two so i'm not exactly sure if this is from the same collection in the heat spending too much time with somebody's hot sun may result in burns okay 
So let's open this candle. And I love the extra protection, okay. This smells so good. This smells so good. It's tropical. And I didn't read the, the scent note. So on Sweet Wave, the top notes are blueberry, strawberry, raspberry. That's what I'm smelling. It smells so good. It smells fresh, but it's still sweet. And then the heart notes are jasmine, coconut. The base notes are vanilla and musk. It's like the perfect blend. This reminds me of like a childhood lip gloss. That is what I'm getting as I smell this. It's bringing back, these candles are bringing back memories. So this is Sweet Wave. This is something I definitely, I believe I will enjoy burning. So guess what guys, I have an extra candle. And I'm going to tell you how it's extra. Because I purchased it when I purchased, you know, the first uh, batch of candles. This was over a year ago. And so I am a type of person, like, if I'm, like, at the end of something, I want to, like, save it until I get more. I know that might be a little, you know, you know, I'm still being worked on. But I kept the one of the last candles that I had. And this one was Grown Folks business okay you know growing up your parents would tell you to stay out of grown folks business so this candle is grown folks business i have actually had this like on the shelf like um for probably a year at least maybe a year plus maybe like almost a year or a little more than a year but it's definitely been up there at least a year and i haven't burnt it because i wanted to make sure that i got more before i burnt this last one okay this one is smelling very, it really does smell like grown folk, like business person. Like, um, yeah, I'm about my business. That's what I get when I smell this. So I'm actually gonna look on the website for the note description because I don't have the box for this because I've had it for so long. Okay, so I could not find this one on the website so i'm not sure if it's discontinued or they have just rebranded it or i'm not sure exactly what the reason i'm not seeing it on the website anymore i'm not sure if they'll re-update but those are the candles that i have purchased so guys i hope you enjoy watching this candle video if you're somebody who likes candles and you just want a luxury candle fill if you just want something different, you just want to, you know, step up your candle game a little bit. I feel like this is a great candle line to try and just see what's for you. If it's for you, it's for you. Okay, so thank you guys for watching this video. You'll see me on the next video. I do have some more videos coming out. And so I plan to get working on them and getting them rolled out very shortly. So you guys have a blessed day. Bye.